So this is an interesting problem from ISI entrance, we start beam at the entrance. You can check the link in the description for more such problems. It's related to geometry. And it's actually something called an optimization problem. Optimization. So you want to maximize or minimize a particular thing. And the thing that we would like to maximize or minimize is the area. So let me explain what the problem is. The problem says that we have a given number, let's call that the perimeter. The perimeter P or we can actually fix it at a particular number, let's say 10. This is fixed. Now there are many triangles, there are many triangles that can be drawn using this perimeter. There are many triangles with the same perimeter. The question is this, which one, which one has the maximum area, maximum area. So we would like to maximize the area by fixing the perimeter. It's a very nice problem and with a very simple solution. Uh, let's draw a triangle ABC, one triangle, one such triangle with perimeter P. So this is capital A, capital B, capital C. This is small a, small b, small c. Now the perimeter, perimeter is small a plus small b plus small c. And sometimes we also use the semi-perimeter, which is also an important quantity. This is just A plus B plus C by 2. Now, there is a formula for area of a triangle. This is S, suppose. Stress semi-perimeter is S. And area is square root of S into S minus A into S minus B into S minus C. It's sometimes known as the Heron's formula. The Heron's formula. So what we would like to do is to maximize this area. Now, notice that the semi-perimeter is fixed. I mean, if, if we fix the perimeter, clearly the semi-perimeter is also fixed. So if we can maximize this portion that is S minus A into S minus B into S minus C. If we can maximize this, then we would be done. So here is our new goal. Our new goal. To maximize S minus A into S minus B into S minus C. Once we are able to maximize this product, we will be able to maximize S times this product because X, S is fixed and we would be able to maximize the square root of that. Therefore, the area would be maximized, right? So, how do we maximize this product? Well, we will use something called the AMGM inequality, which basically says that arithmetic mean, arithmetic mean is always greater than or equal to geometric mean and the equality holds equality holds that means both of them are equal both of them are equal only when all terms are equal so sometimes people miss this part of the statement because this is a very, very, this is a very, very important part actually. That when does equality hold? Well, it holds when all the terms are equal. Okay. So now, let's 
write down the arithmetic mean of s minus a plus s minus b plus s minus c divided by 3. That's the arithmetic mean, the average, which is a fixed number, by the way, because this is 3s minus 2s by 3, right? Uh, a plus B plus C is two times the Sadipathian perimeter. So 3S minus 2S by 3, which is just S by 3. So since the perimeter is fixed, therefore this quantity is also fixed, that is S by 3. Now that is always greater than or equal to the geometric mean, that is S minus A, S minus B, S minus C to the power one third. So, now notice this very carefully. What we are suggesting is that S minus A, S minus B, S minus C is always less than S by 3 whole cube, which is a constant number. Constant number. Why? Because perimeter is constant. So, S by 3 is constant, so S by 3 whole cube is constant. So this product is always less than this constant number, but it's equal to this constant number when everything is equal. So, S, when S minus A is equal to S minus B is equal to S minus C, then this product maximizes maximizes and becomes equal to s by 3 whole q okay that's what the inequality says and that's what we want we want this product to maximize so what does s minus a s minus b s minus c equal mean i leave that part to your judgment what does what kind of triangle has the property that s minus a is equal to s minus b is equal to s minus c can you give that in the comment section and you can also check the link in the description for other courses at chanta related to isi cmi entrances math olympiad and physics olympiad and so on thank you for watching this video i will see you with the next one